mask triggers music. Five, huh? Yup. So, how much energy did you put into promoting it? Instagram, YouTube, Facebook, the whole thing. Uh, none. None. No, none. Did you promote it at all? No. Are you going to promote it? No. It's Mass Trigger's Music 5. It's got an underground cult following, dude. Mass Trigger's 1, it was just phenomenal. I had phenomenal success with it. I never had it. As soon as I released Mass Trigger's 1, 2, and 3, I, I, for the most part, stopped washing dishes. I just kept on with, well, you know. Keep on being who I am as it relates to, to you know to barbecue game and so I guess for mass triggers music five I've opted to not go the screaming yelling red-faced angry dude and go take it like a whole different angle, bro. That's all I'm saying. So, no. Uh -uh. Mass Trigger's Music 5 is going to be an internet sensation. It's going to get us out of debt. Probably going to get me out of student loan debt, but, that, you know, I won't hold my breath. But, you know. And if I could pay for my mortgage pay my mortgage off with it that'd be great so <clears throat> no if I'm not promoting it B ladies and gentlemen boys and girls children of all ages washing of the dishes is real mask triggers music five Check. Check. Kimchi glass. Check. But I'm drinking coffee. Hot sauce, cigar box, guitar kitchen. Uh, where we wash dishes, bro. Hot sauce, cigar box, guitar kitchen. Mask, triggers, music, five. Oh boy, here it comes right here. Go on, man, get it. Devil bowed his head because he knew that he'd been beat. He laid that golden fiddle down to the ground at Johnny's feet. Oh, this is the good part right here. Johnny said, you come on back now, him, if you ever want to try again. Because I told you once, you... <laughs> Wisdom with Captain Helen Mad Murdoch. Here's what happens when people get locked down and cooped up. Hey, old son. What am up, my dude? Hey. Let's get that camera right. What are you doing, chicken? Little chicken. You done in here?
But I'll tell you what, man, that song right there be working. Hey, look, uh, what about some Dave Matthews? You know any MMO songs? Finished. Simple. Easy. Respectively. Sledgehammer handle on, well, technically speaking, it began life as a diddly bow, but I didn't know if I wanted to put this, attach it right to the top of here. So I put it in here, and then when I was laying it out, I happened to have this oddball box right here, like this strange sort of box here. And I've never known what to do with it. I've had it for like two or three years now. I slid the top of it off, and this all kind of just went together like Legos. You know what I'm saying? It just, it wasn't really any super planning here. Hold on, I gotta go change my shots. Here comes the, here comes the funny games. Murdoch! Dave who? You know, you know, Dave? That old boy down by the river? You're such a douche. <laughs> Every time they have their dog out there, he's gonna go crazy. No, it's not funny. It's not cute. I'm not playing with you, dude. Get You're actually getting on my nerves. Note to self. Dude, you cannot film with Captain Helen Mad Murdoch. Ever. With him anywhere in the vicinity. If you're trying to focus. I can't even think now. <laughs> Anywho. Oddball scale. Roughly 26. But I didn't really measure anything out. I just had this space in this space it comes out to like 26 and a half like from wh wherever this takeoff point is inside of here so diddly bow fused with a cigar box kind of like a cigar box guitar diddly bow three hooks in the bottom and anyways uh, i notched the side of it right here to give you some kind of idea of where you're at but these really aren't perfect they're just there you know to, to help you navigate when you go to zoom in here and use your ear i'm working on a on a fun song like a quasi protest song kind of like a just a silly song and i went with the weirdness of what's going on here when you're hitting the string and how like you're hitting it here but the the nature of this handle isn't completely flat so all kinds of spontaneous fun things are happening recording wise so the important thing for me here is is to stay remotely in the places where i'm supposed to be as far as hitting notes and get this dude i haven't even i have no idea what this is tuned to i haven't taken it to a tuner i've just tuned it up by ear and I've recorded with it. I know I wanna be in here for like the main hook, like the verse, if you wanna call it that, and then somewhat of a bridge or a, somewhat of a bridge or a chorus up in here. But again, this is a real, I'm just writing a real, <clears throat> you can really do cool things with these cigar box guitars and when you're making, um, handmade instruments i'm intentionally going for the chaotic tired woozy hang on to hope endure and persist i'm kind of going for that sound here yelling yelling and screaming hasn't really worked especially with protesting listen to the first few songs you know artistically i'm like stop whining the mask you know screaming and yelling and spin blah 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 and you know so this one, I'm gonna go a little bit more smooth. I don't know, dude. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna, I don't know. I'm just kind of going with the, the way I actually feel about all this right now. It's like, you don't want to, right, your hands are tied, dude. I mean, what are you really gonna do? Write your governor? Like, seriously? <laughs> okay. <laughs> I won't, I won't insulate mandates like I, didn't do three years ago, even though you all complained about it. So I don't know. I'm just going to giggle and laugh and pray to Jesus and try to maintain a joyful disposition. And the one thing I knew that we are commanded to do and we're told to do is pray. I don't know where, where, where we are commanded to go protest 
scream and yell and jump up and down on stage and scream and yell. But I'm down for it. That's cool with me. My brother, he was like, he was fishing. He said, hey, Dave. He said, Daddy, remember? He was, he was casting that rod, trying to teach that old boy how to fish. You said, Daddy. He said, hey, Dave. Daddy. He kept, show, he kept showing the way it worked. No, oh, man, I don't know no, I don't remember no Dave. He said, bump, 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 bump. Here's what happens when people get locked down and cooped up. Wisdom with Captain Helen Mad Murdoch. Yo, I'm talking no rock down 2.0. Don't lock me down. I'm on the dance floor. That's what I would write. Right here. I write down right there. No mask, no mandate, no backs, no death rate.
What are you doing, chicken? Little chicken. You done in here? Did you dig it? Keep oil in your lamps, my friends. Watch and pray. If you guys are not into being locked down, you've got to contact your local representatives. Ted Nugent calls them, or has taught us to call them, our hired employees. Uh, we pay taxes to them. They cannot sit there and just make decisions upon high and come down to you chickens. You guys got to fight. You know what I'm saying? You guys got to rally together. Look, there's golden ones. There's brown speckled ones. There's black ones. There's redheads. There's cute ones like Gale. Hi, Gale. Good to see ya. And then there's the cat. <laughs> uh-huh. Thanks for messing up my shot, as usual. Sorry. I mean, dude, powerful, dude. I'm gonna get tore up on some mineral water now. Get her done at. I need to get the. I need to pick the girls up. Wash the little dishes. Uh oh. Uh oh. Look at Cambry. Okay. What's this? Two hot sauce cigar box guitar kitchen. Watch and pray. Oh, you. <gasps> Del Puckett? From Del Puckett, the North Pole? Dude. The true North Pole? Oh, he's in the know, bro. He knows what's up. See? It's getting ready to go down, old son. Look. 